Hi, Veronica. Hello. How are you? I'm so good. How are you doing? I'm doing great now that you're here. Thank you so much for coming. I'm so excited. Let's smell these scents. I picked two fragrances specifically for you today that I think you are going to find very challenging to pick between the two, and you're about to see why. Close your eyes and stick out your wrists. First of all, on your left hand, go. And now on your right hand, keep your eyes closed. Okay, Ooh. put your uh, put your right hand behind your back. Okay. And open your eyes. What's your first impression? Cardigan. It's like someone wearing a cardigan. <laughs> it's not just one word. I really like that it's, I'm just going like, I'm just rainbowing myself. As you get closer and farther away from it, I think kind of different smells come out. Okay, well before it settles too much, let's put yeah. that one down and have a first impression of your right hand. Yeah. Oh, lemon. Like a very, like maybe like a hotel bathroom. <laughs> Clean like a hotel a, bathroom. Yes. But like one, the one that you want to stay in for a while because it's very nice and it has very chic towels. It, I feel like it's already drying down a little bit. So the yeah. top note might be kind of fading. So yes. what we want to do is just take a couple of minutes here and we're going to let them dry down and then we'll be right back. I love it. Let's do it. Go back to your left wrist and tell me how much or if that has changed at all now that it's settling in. Yeah, kind of like Valentine's Day, mm -hmm. like a Valentine's Day date. Okay, I let's like go to your right it. hand now that that's dried down a bit. How does that one smell now? It's very fresh. It's someone that I want to be around. Um, yeah, late 20s, early 30s. You have to get kind of close to really smell it. This one I kind of smelled instinctually. This one, you had to get kind of close a little bit. But it's kind of overall giving me a sense. For example, if they were to walk by in a room, I think I would smell like, oh, that smelled fresh. And what yeah. about the one on your left hand? How, what age group is that kind of, you think? I would say like, like 40s, okay. 40s, yeah. Which one of these two would you find more sexy to smell on a guy? Yeah, probably the left hand. It kind of gives me feelings of comfort and settled and someone who knows themselves, mm -hmm. and, but also bold enough to wear a, a scent like this. You mm. can only pick one fragrance to do the photo shoot with. Mm. Who's gonna be the winner? What? Wow, the one on your left? Yeah, Okay, fantastic. So. Well, uh, before I show you the one on your left, I will show you the one on your right. You can go ahead and take that and hold that up. This Ooh. is, what a great bottle. This is from John Varvados. This is Artisan Pure. It's a very fresh, it's almost like you said, it's, it's people kind of refer to this as a vacation or almost like a beachy kind of thing, yes. you know, but it does have kind of some woody notes in the base. It has a warmth to it that you kind of smell. Mm -hmm. So you really pick that out. Ooh. This is the one you did pick, and this is by Jean-Paul Gaultier, <laughs> and it is called Le Mail. <laughs> Sorry, I can't help but laugh when I look at this. I giggle, oh my God, a butt. <laughs> I love that though. That's what, I'm, that's what I was saying about bold. I feel like the person that wears this is bold. Like, I'm gonna buy this bottle. To buy this bottle and to go up to the cash register and say, this is the one. <laughs> How was that? Mmm, yeah. yeah, candy, like in a candy store. And are you ready now to do a photo shoot with Jean-Paul Gaultier Le Mail? I am, let's do it. I found these photographs. 